I listened to NF for the very first time back in January, where you listened to Let You Down, Lie, and The Search, and a lot of people like that initial episode to where they've requested more. And I've made five episodes now reacting to NF, with this one being the six. Full episode links down in the description box below to see what songs we've done. But a lot of people wanted me to do a full album reaction to the new NF album, Hope, which came out last Friday at the time of recording. And I'm a man of the people. I'm here to please so here we go good morning good afternoon good night depending on when you're watching this how's it going guys first off hope you're having a good day today hope your day's going well and hope it continues to go well here is my hope reactions and yes i know the happy has a music video as well we will jump to that music video when the time comes and in this video we are not going to show my my reactions to hope and Mo because those have been released and you can check out those episodes down in the description box below so we're going to do songs 13 through i mean three through 13 so without further ado here we go i'm super tired I've been up since 4 30 this morning but alas here is my hope by nf reactions kicking us off careful featuring i want to say corday i'm really digging the sloop here it's cool Stun on me, you get exposed. I don't wanna pick then a bite bowl. Doesn't go plat, it'll go go. Keep it up front now, tiptoe. I'll be at the house trying to lay low. Ducking and dodging a promo. Sit on my roof like J. Cole. Yeah, sit on my roof like J. Cole. Get it, I got it, I'm with it, I'm body. My crib is exotic, I'm blessed. Hey, we live in chaotic, what's high off narcotics? But that's when my life is a mess. Hey, we come from the bottom, we still at the bottom. I get how to really distress. Hey, I don't think y'all get the message. This world is built off misconceptions. Talking about lost souls. At a crossroads, money coming in in large loads. I've been crossed, so my heart cold. That's all we know. I love the reverb that's just on the end of these. Souls at a crossroads, money coming in in large loads. I've been crossed, so my heart cold. That's all. Love that. And also just loving uh, Corday's flow in this. Like, it's, it's super cool. And the lyrics in here is interesting. And it was also really cool because talking about how at one time living living life we live in chaotic how's narcotics but that was my life was a mess and just like just talking about life now versus then in there and just re remaining faithful as it says in there super cool so far the beats nice dig it doesn't go plat, it'll go go. Having to look at the total, you know you've been blessed. Sharing the wealth ain't no point in me keeping this all to myself. I ain't taking this money with me to my grave. Yeah, I might as well bless all the people I love. We talking about making a difference, I'm making one. Talking about risks, I've been taking them. Talking about dreams, I've been chasing them. Talking about lives, I've been changing them. Talking about family, don't play with them. Woo! That's a line you don't cross, no. Low blows, can't There is something cool happening in the backgrounds of everything. It's like they took that vocal sample from the very beginning, 238, this part, but you're putting it through some sort of gated effect to where you get to a part where, where was we in here? It's just happening in the background and it's super cool. Just listen for like that vocal sample, just like, eh, eh, like you're, you're flipping a switch, turning it on and off. Super cool. Keep the loved ones close. That's all we know. Stun on me. Cool. And that was careful. And I really find the cool that like the lyrics that NF is talking about, he's talking about giving back because he can't take all the money to the graves. So he's like, hey, you know what? Here's what I'm going to do. Daddy, you want to retire? Go ahead and retire. Grandma, let's get you your own place in just talking about making a difference. Absolutely love that. And the song just being thankful, being grateful. Love that. Super cool. And now I move on to uh, Mama. I just realized this one's going to be an emotional one because I did listen to How Could You Leave Us and oh boy, 
that was about his mom. So, already already know this is gonna be sad, isn't it? Yeah. You ever make it up to the gate? And if you did, I wonder is it a beautiful place? Did he put his arms around you, make you feel like you're safe? Did he grab you by the hand and say that things are okay? You got their disease breath, take you closer to God. Would you say that you cry less? Do you feel at peace yet? Do you laugh more? You feel like heaven is everything you could ask for. I ever make it up there when I see you, I hope you're smiling because you deserve it. Pray to God that you found joy and always know that. Ah, yes. Oh, this, yep, this is a sad one. Oh, and like it, it's a great therapy song. Like, just it's good. It's already a great song because, yeah, just getting the feelings off your chest and just asking the questions that you do wonder sometimes because you wonder if loved ones make it up to heaven and all. Of these questions, you wonder how they're doing. You think about them frequently, always in their mind, especially if they're a parental figure, such as a mother in F's case. So, this is a good one. You don't gotta cry. You don't gotta cry no more. Nobody's perfect. Yeah, I guess we all fall short. And I can't hold this unforgiveness in my heart no more. So just know you're lovable to me, and of course, you'll always be mama to us. So save a table for four and know that. You don't gotta cry, you don't gotta cry no more I hope you're up there looking down on us with a smile on your face You don't gotta cry, you don't gotta cry no more I hope you're up there with God feeling loved and set free from your pain But I'll get there eventually so don't you worry none I just hope you finally got some peace and you feel happy mom I love you No, that one's a really good one. Like the lyrics in it, it's beautiful. This piano ending is beautiful. Love it. Nothing bad I can say about it. It's really good. Really good. I was happy that he can express himself in a way that it's like a therapy. And now I move on to the song Happy. So which means we get to pull up the music video now. Do it this way so that way I can see what I'm doing. Cool. We're still recording. Still recording. Cool. Here we go. Like in the violin. God, please hear me out. I know it's been a couple years since I reached. Out and said hello, I bet you're wondering. I was happy. I love that. I absolutely love that music. And I said nothing during a certain like that might just cut straight to the end here, but I was just captivated by it because I just loved watching the parallels of the daughter to in the mother. And like how when you're a child and you you're very impressionable. And like you just seeing how things stem where certain things picked up from and like you really saw that in the parallel especially with like the fight like just the eating for example uh her as a girl getting a bowl from the sink and then putting giving themselves their cereal and then getting the food out of the, the chinese food out of the fridge and then even with the fighting and stuff seeing the parallels between how she fights and how her dad and her mom fight Really cool stuff there. Really cool stuff. So cool. Now I'm gonna skim through the lyrics here. And there'll be a moment. 
And the first set of lyrics are an hour and a half. Dear God, please hear me out. I know it's been a couple of years since I reached out and said hello. I, I bet you're wondering why I keep obsessing on and stressing all these little things when I should be living life and soaking up the memories. Ow. Already ow. It feels like something's off when I'm not depressed. I got some issues that I won't address. I got some baggage that I ain't open yet. I got some demons I should put to rest. I got some traumas that I can't forget. I got some phone calls I've been avoiding. And just goes on there. And that's another owl line. It's a very true line. Definitely could find relatability in my life. Now, this one... I like this one. This one is probably one of my favorites that I've listened to off of this so far. But now we move on from happy. We go to... No. We go to pandemonium. Oh boy. Here we go. Already like this. Something special about me. You can already tell the energy is different. Confidence is at the highest level. I don't ever see it dipping. Did it all without a cosign. Should I always hit the bullseye? Barely even put an effort in this effortless. Imagine if I did try. <laughs> That threw me off, but man, instrumentally so far, this one is it is pretty great. And I have a thought, but I'll save it for the end of this. Acknowledge me or not, that don't really make no difference to me. I operate the same no matter who's around me. Who's around me is important to me. I keep my enemies at arm's length, but close enough to make me feel safe, my. But I'm capable of doing with my talent, stretching my imagination. Watch it turn a small idea into something that you have to. What? 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 Loving the lo-fi piano in this one. Tip you had to when you see it, the whole package ain't got nothing missing. Check off every box, it's unavoidable at this point. Don't you act like what? it's clear to me, I can tell. The foot you put on this in real. That poker face ain't hiding nothing new to hit you have before the country die. The production in this one is great. I this one amazing production on it. I got it's what great. they like, first in every class, never coming last. Jamie's on my back, wifey on my lap, she my better half. Heavy when I stab, pockets getting fat. What you think this is? Deadly with the raps. How could you forget? Thought I might have left. Thought I might have quit. Thought I hung it up. Thought I think again. Petty that depends. What's the latest trend? I don't have a clue. I don't follow them. They just follow me. Keep them on the edge. Keep them on their toes. Keep them on the rent. Keep them wanting more. Eating out my hand. Don't look at the score. Don't look in the stands. Poor and not impressed with me. Ain't looking for endorsements. Dropping masterpieces left and right. Ignore the hate. Life testing me. Passing with flying colors. Always been unique. Can't be no diamond dozen. I take pride in this. Won't catch me cutting corners. Have no tolerance for ignorance. I heard you lost your confidence in me. This this one, like I said, amazing production on this one. And I still have a thought that I think this is in the wrong place on the album. That this should either be earlier or later on. I'll explain more in a bit. However, this one, and this is the current thought I have, this one reminds me of Hope at the very beginning, especially the music video where we saw NF, the, I guess, Mr. Brightside and have the NF wearing white versus what we saw in at the very end. Just him struggling with his the dark parts of his thoughts, playing with his own demon. Especially with like this towards the very end. Have no tolerance for ignorance. I heard you lost your confidence in me. They should be sorry, can That just reminds me of like the ending struggle at the end of that music video in Hope. It's cool. It's cool. Production on this one, amazing. Absolutely love it. Next one. Suffice. Yeah. If I did it, then I did it right. Yes. Yeah. This ain't happened for me overnight. No. Yeah. Bet it gets me, you gon' pay the price. Yeah. Down the business, I ain't playing nice. Be good, it ain't slowing. One after another, man. I just keep going. If I did it, then I did it right. Yes, yes, yes. This ain't happened for me overnight. No, no, no. Better okay, so something annoying me with the lyrics on the screen for Spotify. Anyone can put these lyrics into Music Match. However, that... that ain't happened. If I did it, then I did it right. Yes, yes. That happens once I'm not. Yes, yes. It's just once with delay on it. This ain't happened for me overnight. No, no. Small pet peeve. Nothing to do with the music. But musically so far, it's really good. I'll have more thoughts on the lyrics in a bit, but... Bet it gets me, you gonna pay the price. I'm dumb. <laughs> Down the business, I ain't playing nice. So ahead of y'all, I'm out of sight. When you popping, they don't want to 
slice. Hello, doing things on the phone because the GoPro overheated, but just finished suffice, and I love, love, love the fact that we went into a, another section at the end, like we were in one beat for most of the song, and then towards the end of it, we'd go into a whole different thing, and it's super, super cool. And I absolutely just love this last section of the song. It's my favorite part, because it's just talking about, like, just him and music together. I've been to hell and back ever since I, that first EP came out with all I have on it. Just talking about grieving and the process behind it, and just getting to the result that he wanted. Talking about self-doubts, and it's, it's cool. Can't imagine if I would have gave up and just turned back on this music where I'd be now. Don't know how it would make out from that underneath that rainy cloud. Love it, and especially love this last section at the end where it's just him alone, nothing underneath him, and just his voice ending the song. Super, super cool. And now I am off to bed because, like I said, I've been up since 4 a.m., the GoPro overheating, and also the battery is kind of dying, so I'm going to finish this tomorrow when I wake up, where we will be back on the GoPro, and we'll be listening to Gone, featuring Julia Michaels. Good morning, world. Slept really well. But let's get back into it, shall we? Always saw my glasses, half empty, was never full. You were always passive, and I was irresponsible. Young in love, broken hearts, holding on to our false hope. Had your whole life planned out, I had no clue who I was. Gave it all we had, but guess I all wasn't enough. Sometimes I think of you. That, those lines in there definitely are an hour and a half. Had your whole life planned out, I had no clue who I was. Give it all we had, but I guess our all wasn't enough. I wonder where you're at now. Do you ever find the one? Hope we're out there somewhere happy. Sometimes I still think of you. Ow. And also, instrumentally so far, I'm loving that like there's just this one droning piano note where it's just like... Dee, 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 Love that, it's really cool. And, it makes me and as soon as I say that, the piano line switches to do more things rather than... Where you're at now, did you ever find the one? Hope you're out there somewhere happy, sometimes I think of you. Yeah. And it makes me sad, keep holding on. Wait. <laughs> okay, like I was vibing with that soft, melancholy piano, bringing in the cellos, little bass notes, and then we just get just this explosion. I'm already gone. Like, I thought something went wrong in my software, that it just stopped. <laughs> okay. I see what we're doing. Uh, I could blame us breaking up on being too young and being too dumb and being too caught up on past traumas. But the truth is we just won't cry, we planned a whole life when we both knew We should have just ended on the first night Got carpal tunnel from holding on to what we once felt I'm happy for you, I am You don't get me wrong, I am Yeah, yeah I'm already gone Yeah, no, that song, hour and a half, Julia Michaels verse in here, man, it stung. It absolutely stung. I 
was like just ow. Like, dang. I got carpal tunnel. Hold on, where's the lyric in here? I got carpal tunnel from holding on to what we what we once felt. I'm happy for you, I am. Don't get me wrong, I am. But one and one smile is true, I think of you just like just all of this verse hurts. Which makes it frustrating because I hate this part. I hate it. <laughs> it's I I get it, contrast in there, but musically, I just don't dig it. Which it sucks. Cause it's such a good song. And this part is just to me personally, I'm not a fan of it. Some people, like I said, the song, absolutely beautiful. Love the song itself. Just this one production thing, I'm not a fan of. Which, I think it's just because right now, my ear, it was like, wasn't expecting for it. It's like, ah! You know? <laughs> anyway, let's move on. For bullets. I wouldn't say it if I didn't mean it. You ever need me for any reason, let me know. I got your back, I would die and kill for you. Don't question that, you know it's true, don't pretend you don't. Beautiful is what you are, I know you doubt it daily. Words will never be enough to describe the way we both connected when you had a baby. I'm proud of you, I can't believe it, it still fascinates me. Oh, this song is about his wife. Love that. I absolutely love songs about significant others. They're, they're really pretty and beautiful. Grow. Seems like yesterday we met. Life is flying by, makes me emotional. Just talking about it, got a lot of memories. Things I could never forget, you gave me. When your world starts to crumble, when you think that there's no hope, I got you. No, I was waiting for like the heavy chorus that we got before, but now we just soft uh, world sir piano. Days feel long and the nights get lonely. When your sky goes dark and the rain starts pouring Yeah When the walls cave in and you need somebody Ending on this sample from the beginning, love that Good. Like it. Like the beat. It was good. That was good. Uh, definitely, I'm a sucker for songs about other people's significant others. Like, I love uh, all the 21 Pilots stuff, where it's the lead singer Tyler Joseph singing to his wife, Jenna, and songs like Tear My Heart, Smithereens, and Formidable. Absolutely love this stuff. And it's always good. It's always good. See, just husbands communicating with their wives in the song, be like, here's how much I love you. And I do. And I definitely can relate some of these lyrics to lovely especially uh this part i uh, don't pretend you don't uh don't have that but from the beginning i got your back i would die and kill for you don't question that you know it's true don't pretend you don't beautiful is what you are i know you doubt it daily words can never be enough to describe the way we are i like because you know lovely's pretty <laughs> and she doubts it all the time even though she's the most beautiful person in the world Anyway, enough about my lovely. Let's go to the next song. Turn my back. Hey. Yeah. On even on my off days, right even when I'm off base. Life living like tomorrow ain't promised to me. Gotta get it today. Jaw drop, headliner, top gunner. I catch a real stunner. Y'all got it. New topic. Yay's docker. Mannery was inspirational to me. I love watching. Lames try to keep stars in the dark just because they're afraid of you. It, it's always weird uh, hearing ours talking about Yay, especially for what Yay has been doing. 
recently that, uh, well, I haven't caught up in anything that recent, but like from the comments he said this year. <laughs> How they switch up quick when they realize that your name bus doesn't ring a bell. Every time I look down and your number pops up on the cell. Shake my head, threatening me, trying to get me to respond well. If you really knew me, you would know that that's the quickest way to make me turn. I, I, I'm stopping here because it looks like that this is going to go into the next song just the way the and is. However, every time I doesn't ring a bell, every time I... There's like a guitar thing happening here, which is really cool. Uh, and my thoughts about this one, love the beat of it. Uh, my interpretation of it is this is uh, NF talking about himself at first. Like, yeah, here's what I like. Here's my li little list of names I really like. Drake M, Dre, Cole, Kendrick, uh, Corday, Sean Black. Those are my names. I like those guys. And it's like then just talking about going in on the people who doubted him, who's hated him. And it was like saying, this is why I am, this is what you are. Like a little, like, dig towards the haters, whether that be of the old past generation, whether it be these people just wanting to start beef just to get an attention name for themselves. And, yeah, so, it's good. It is good, and now let's move on to whatever the next song is. If you really knew me, you would know that that's the quickest way to make me turn my back on you and Oh, it's not gonna bang to the next one. Just give me this cool little guitar loop. Cool though. I feel like I'm at a standstill, waiting for you to tell me I'm okay. If time heals, tell me why do I kill myself, trying to show you I'm not a mistake. Ow! I've got quality. Ow! That line hurts. If time heals, tell me why do I kill myself trying to show you I'm not a mistake. Ow. I'm not proud of. I've made promises that I walked out on. I've had days I feel I don't deserve love. So think what you think. Just don't call me a mistake. I feel like I'm at a standstill. Waiting for you to tell me I'm all loving. Okay. The cello if that's in here now. Hills, tell me why do I kill myself trying to show you I'm not a mistake. I've got qualities that I'm not proud of. I've made promises that I walked out on. I've had days I feel I don't deserve love. So think what you think. Just don't call me up. Walked out on. Days I feel I don't deserve love. So think what you think. Just don't call me a mistake. Yeah, no, this one is my favorite. This is my favorite song that I've heard on the album so far. Like, I've been looking for that relatable NF song. Because I remember going into it, a lot of people was like, a lot of people like NF because a lot of people find the songs relatable. And I definitely understand how, by going through all these songs, listening to the lyrics, reading the lyrics too. I, I definitely understand how people can relate, but I'm trying to find my one song where I relate to the most. And this is it. This right here is the one that I relate to the most. And oh boy, ow, almost got me crying, but it's a great song. Great song. I'm glad that it didn't go heavy. I'm glad it just stayed cello, piano, and him. It's perfect. Now I move on to the next. Let him pray. I've seen it take a toll and be harmful I've seen what it can do when I got both of my arms full But still continue to pile more on my back though Hey, I ain't got no room to grow, I would never say Conversations with the Lord should be every day Reconnecting with my core, get my head on straight Praying on my downfall, let him pray Resonate, blood 
sweating tears on the 808s. See him praying on my downfall. Let him pray. Let him pray. This took a turn. This took a turn. I like when I saw the title. I'm like, cool. Uh, like it's gonna encourage encourage more people to pray. And, like I thought it was gonna go into it when it and F was. Uh, where are we at? In here, conversations with the Lord should be every day. Thought we were gonna go resonant, reconnecting with my core, keeping my head straight, and then it just goes into praying for my downfall. <laughs> And let see him praying for my downfall. Let him pray. And like that took a turn to where I thought it was going to like going to go. Okay, I'm. Let's see where this goes. Would not have got to experience if I'd have let the mistakes that I made rob me of my full potential. Life will test you. Don't forget to remember the fundamentals. Woo! I am loving the flow in that part. That it, it, it switches it up. It's cool. To get back to those. Be surprised what you find when you climb out your comfort zone. Let's keep on pushing. Keep on healing. See you praying. All my downfall gone. Keep on praying. God ain't listening to you. <laughs> Resume. Resume. <laughs> Check the resume. Hey, see him praying on my downfall. Let him pray. Song. Not what I was expecting at all. But it's, it's still really cool. Still really cool. Definitely dug that one. Now I move into running, which I think is the last one, if not one of the last ones on the album. It is the last one on here. So here is the final song off of Hope Running. Ooh. Got my attention, Mr. Guitar Player Me. <laughs> I'm tired. Holding on to you, it's time to lay. Hesitated on my life, but I'm all done. I'm done running from you. Spent my whole life in your shadow, scared of who I'd be if I. Yeah. Say goodbye and I didn't have you here I wish you well but I can no longer stand this I can watch you sabotage the two of us I love you to death but I can't spend the rest of my life in this I'm loving the production of this one. Oh my gosh, like the guitar at the beginning, then coming in with the classic NF piano, lower notes on the piano, and then just like building, building, building up in there. It's really cool. And lyrics I'm loving so far. Like, if it, this is a great song. I love it. Now we're back down to this acoustic. It's great. I wish you the Ooh. best, but. I'm not interested in giving you more of my life. I've already given you too much. I don't want to lose you. I don't want to keep you. I know that you mean well, but when I fail, I don't need you. I hate seeing you cry, but I think it's time to let go and say goodbye. Yeah, I'm going to miss you, but I'm not going to spend the rest of my life running from you. That part was cool. That part was really cool. Spend my whole life in your shadow. Scared. Of who I'd be if I said goodbye and I didn't have you here. I wish you well, but I can no longer stand this. I can watch you sabotage the two of us. I love you. I'm done. 
And that was the entirety of NF's Hope. Now that, that song, Running, was really cool. I, I, ah, it's between this and Mistake as my favorite song off of the album. They're so good. Pandemonium is a strong third. I still feel like Pandemonium is in the wrong spot on the album. Can you load? I guess we have to do it the hard way. Just go back and do that. Load the album track list. Or not. <laughs> Okay, that's fine. I don't know. The thing I was going to say about Pandemonium being in the wrong place in the album is like, to me, it feels like it should go more towards the end or more towards the beginning rather than the section that's right in the middle. Like, I feel like Running is a great, great cl album closer. It reminds me a lot of ending with Leave the City or Truce. But specifically, Leave the City by Tony on Pilots, just because you just get that build up at the end that was going to go very well in concerts. Like, that's going to go super, super hard. But, yeah, it's good. It is good. The overall album I thought was really good. NF typically isn't my taste of music, and but there's some songs there that I found really amazing, really beautiful. There's songs in there like Careful, I Didn't Care For. And there's songs where it's like, you can't really judge it, like Mama, as well as the song about his wife that was in here. What was it? Not Let Him Pray, Not Mistake, Not to Bullet, that's it. Yeah, Bullet was really good. Gone, good. <laughs> and though the, the Gone has is one of my most frustrating songs off of here just because of that middle section. If that was changed, it would have been perfect, but alas. But overall, good album. Good album. Some songs there that I enjoy on there. And like I said, I... <laughs> I, I, it's like my me listening to NF has always been the struggle because like I want to get into NF, but for whatever reason, I can't really get into it. There's some songs there were like, yeah, no, this is super cool. And I found the one song I find super relatable in my life, but am I going to go back and listen to the album frequently? Maybe not so, just because it's not my typical style of music. Like, I love running because there's guitar in it and. I don't know. I'm weird. Music is subjective, and I'm not bashing NF at all. I'm not bashing it. Like I said, I can find how people find his lyrics super relatable. The beat's good. His rapping's good. He is great. He's, like, he's an amazing artist, and, like, I appreciate everything he's done, but unfortunately, for whatever reason, there's something up here that can't flip the switch and turning it on to I really like Anna Foley. It's like my issue with My Chemical Romance to where I want to get into them. It should be in my wheelhouse considering I love 21 Pilots and Fall Out Boy and stuff, but for whatever reason, it just switch is not flipping. And that's where I am with NF, and it's frustrating because, like I said, I want to get into NF. And it sucks. But, no, the, uh, but the album doesn't suck. He doesn't make sucky songs, for the most part. <laughs> Lies is still not a great song, in my opinion. Uh, Careful is pretty mad, in my opinion. But other than that, it's a good album. It's a good album. But anyway, guys, what do you think of it? Down and let me know down in the comments section below. I'll see you guys tomorrow with... What am I doing tomorrow? I'm listening to Wallows for the first time. Tomorrow, Wednesday, I'm listening to Peter McPoland's new song. I'm doing a 21 Pilot thing on Wednesday, where that's what we do. Typically on this channel, we talk a lot about 21 Pilot and stuff. And on Friday, in a stark contrast, I'm doing another full album listening of Metallica's 72 Seasons. But anyway, guys, I'm going to end this video, and I'll see you all later. Goodbye. And more importantly, have a good day, and I'll see you later.